I'm going to investigate the body I found overlooking Divinity Churchyard. There's a killer at large. He must be stopped. found a mutilated body, but this isn't the one Cash told me about. I'm going to try and establish a cause of death. Blood tests reveal the cause of death was an overdose of painkillers leading to cardiac arrest. Also, the victim's fingerprints have been burned off with acid. A rather unsavory demise. That's not all. It's as though the subject's DNA has been corrupted somehow. There's insufficient information for me to cross-reference the database. I'll have to use the deep tissue scanner to analyze the body for distinguishing features and determine the victim's identity. Right you are, sir. The position of this scar indicates the victim underwent surgery to remove one of their kidneys. A plate made of tantalum, used here for a cranial fracture, most probably the result of a boxing accident. The victim's callous knuckles would only be acquired by a professional fighter. This wound is relatively fresh, inflicted while the victim was still alive. Abrasion to the epidermal layers confirms the somewhat crude removal of a tattoo. Alfred, the victim's name is Ella Montgomery. It appears the kidney was donated to a twin sister who unfortunately died. This seems to have been the catalyst for her boxing pursuits, and hence the cranial injury. She went missing in Huntsville, Alabama. What's unusual is that they didn't go missing in Gotham. They were brought here and killed. Why? We need to track down whoever did this. Might I suggest keeping an ear out for any more of that ghastly opera music? It sounds ominously like a calling card. I'm headed to Divinity Church. Riddler won't give up, Alfred. His pride won't let him. You'll break his spirit, sir. I have every confidence. Oh, man! It's him! Don't worry! He ain't catching us! The unexamined life is not worth living, Detective. And I've been wondering why I let you aggravate me so. You're a cheat and a liar. A dressed up strong man playing with expensive toys. World's greatest detective. Ha! And everyone from Gotham to Star City believes it. I cannot abide a fraud detective, a dilettante masquerading amongst his intellectual betters, stealing every last scrap of appreciation, dignity, and respect.
Welcome, detective, to the drain I'm going to figuratively and quite possibly literally flush you down. The goal of this aquatic examination could not be simpler, detective. Lower the water, like so. Before that, however, it's time for a riddle. Riddle me this, detective. What do bats do when they're at home? Done, detective. I think you're getting the hang of it. That's one bad man. The water might be lower, but you're still out of your depth. Water is almost as low as Catwoman's chances of freedom. Why don't you celebrate with my friend? You know what? I wanted you to destroy the robots. I did. I did. It. It's all part of my immaculately constructed master plan. So there. Barely keeping up to the precise degree my equations predict. Predict. Careful on your way out. really comes down to user error.
Hey, Eddie. Can't we play a different game? This one's getting old. Here's hoping Eddie hasn't started cheating. And they say black cats are bad luck. Another key. Well done. <laughs> of course, you'll lose all nine lives in an instant should I push this detonator. Another door unlocked. What a surprise. been the smartest man in the room, Detective, forced to endure the suspicions and mockery of those whose meager mental faculties prohibited them from appreciating that fact. And then you appear in Gotham, dressing up your cognitive capabilities, marginally superior as they are to that of the average hoodlum, in the guise of a crusading hero. And oh, how the people swoon! To the orphanage, hero! It's time to rejoin Catwoman for another try. The militia have stationed themselves by Penitence Bridge. They should have run. Bravery won't help.
I've taken out one of the militia's APCs. I need the driver picked up and taken back to GCPD. I'll get someone on it, Batman. Alfred, I'm going to investigate the seismic activity on Miyagani Island. I fear it's not going to be good news, sir. It seems nothing tonight is. Alfred, I've located the source of the seismic activity. It appears to be increasing in frequency. I know what it is, and it's not good. Baby, stop! You just gave away your location. It's time for Scarecrow to pay for what he did to me. I hope you're ready. He's going to throw everything he's got at us. I'll wreck his little tin toys. Drones engaging. Make it count! Drone flank initiated! They won't. I can't.
can't help you further, Batman. I'm not strong enough yet.
to support. I can't stop him! You don't need to. back to GCPD before the Arkham Knight launches another assault. It's too dangerous to leave her exposed. safe here. The Knight knows where you are. You're coming with me. I won't leave them. They can't do it alone. They need me. Sir, I think you may wish to take a look at Perdition Bridge. The Batwing has located the Cloudburst. Scans reveal it is manned and emitting a huge amount of energy. The Arkham Knight. It's worse than I thought. My plants are dying. The cloudburst is amplifying the effect of the toxin. You need to destroy that device, or my plants won't be able to protect Gotham. You'll die if you stay here. We'll both die unless you stop it. I know, Alfred. It's bad. And, sir, the Cloudburst's energy field burnt out the Batmobile's power core. What will you do? I'm going after Stag. He created the Cloudburst. He'll have the means to destroy it. Very astute, Master Bruce. I only hope you can find him. But please, sir, be careful of the gas. 